You know what else has changed our whole image is uh, Jenny McCarthy. I was just talking about this the other day. Jenny used to come in, do the show, talk about, like, you know, hot shit that happened to her. With then, Jenna Jameson and whoever. Yeah, and then you could pull her finger. She talked about, oh, I love when people pull my finger and I fart and all this stuff. So now... Get in a tickle chair. She latched on to Jim Carrey. And she's on... Like, she doesn't come do this show anymore. She does Regis and Kelly and... All of the really kind of safe shows. Larry King, and, Oprah. Yeah, and dresses in like very appropriate clothing. And I was just thinking, like, wow, you know, you know, hooking up with Jim Carrey really was the lottery for her. Because where was she going with the other stuff? It was kind of not going anywhere. And now she's an expert on kids. I she's, mean, she's, she's going a real bore. To testify. Yeah, I guess it. it you know, a I mean, socialite. Yeah, and I guess Jim likes it because it gives her a certain legitimacy and. Uh, here's a clip from Jenny McCarthy, the new Jenny McCarthy on Regis and Kelly. Jenny McCarthy has just put together a uh, DVD. That's right. Teach to talk. Tell Teach me what that talk. means. Um, well, basically, I re a few years ago, Evan... God, she used to be so much fun. I was sitting on the ground and fighting with a friend, and I went, God, you know, I wish there was a DVD that taught sharing and taking turns. And then I went... Child expert. Ding! And created a little video, and mm -hmm. from there, we have 14 now titles at Teach to Talk. You know, because a lot of things are, we're always so focused on as parents as, can my baby be the... I like the desperate Jenny McCarthy was getting older, had the autistic son, would come in here, Jenna Jameson, sexuality. I like what was that? What was that Super Bowl pre-halftime mm. uh, thing that used to happen? Wasn't she a part of that? Yeah, like that. yeah, the 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 um, where the chicks would play the lingerie yeah, bowl. Yeah, yeah, the lingerie bowl. Yeah, that was hot. That was the hot Jenny. Uh, Howard, I'm here for the lingerie bowl. <laughs> What's that, Jenny? <laughs> well, most of us get pretty naked. I'm not fully nude or anything, but most of the girls play football and their lingerie comes. It gets torn off, <laughs> and it's so much better than what's going on in the halftime. That was the year I think Janet Jackson. Showed them all up and pulled her titty out. Right, right. She was like, hey. Took back those ratings. Obviously, she was threatened by the lingerie balls competition. But uh, that was the Jenny that was fun. Oh, yeah, I was in this bathroom, and, and then, like, Jenna Jameson started licking my pussy. <laughs> really? She, I don't hear her going, hey, Regis, did anyone ever tell you the story when Jenna Jameson was licking my pussy? I made a DVD. <laughs> well, actually, Jenny denied Jenna's whole story. I should say that. That's true. Jenna yeah. Jameson told us that story. Right, right, right. It wasn't Jenny. And who knows what Jenna's up to? Who knows what her agenda is? <laughs> <laughs> but Jenny Smart. did tell us she was into, like, interesting things. Yeah. A lot more interesting than this book for kids. This one is class. Right. Uh -huh. But we're forgetting about two major core things, which is social skills and uh, behavior. Yes, absolutely. You, know, oh my so gosh, you should make this for adults. Bridge is like, oh, yes, absolutely. What are we talking about? He's half asleep. He's on autopilot. <laughs> he just wants to get to the gym. I do. It's, you know, you have to teach them young. So, you know, the Jenny, take off your top. These videos, the, the new one that I'm promoting now is Behaviors with Friends, teaching, you know, not to hit, to resolve mm -hmm. conflict with using your words, not to be a bully, mm -hmm. things that they're not really teaching in school. Yeah. How to be a pussy, in other words. Oh, they, 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 they never taught not to be a bully in mm. school. The kids who need the book on how not to be a bully. We'll Ain't gonna, yeah, they're not getting the Jenny McCarthy series, trust me. I've, I've met many a bully in my life. They somehow, <laughs> Their parents were sitting on the floor with them watching DVDs. Their bullying usually is uh, comes hand in hand with the fact that they're being ignored by their parents. Yeah. You know, when they're angry. And they're not reading. Yeah. Or bullied by their parents. I wish when I lived in Roosevelt I would have had that book because I would have taken that book and hit the other kids with it yeah. to defend myself. <laughs> well, wouldn't you have brought the other kids in who were bothering yeah. you and thrown them the DVD? I actually beat up a kid with a book in school. Nice. He, 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 had, um, he was sitting in front of me. I told you the story. He punched me in the face. Yeah. He just turned around in English class and punched me square on in the face. <laughs> I took my books, every one of them. I slammed his head so hard it went right into the front of the desk oh. with a book. Just right into the back of his head went right down. <laughs> <laughs> and then him and his two friends beat the shit out of me after oh, school, but God. I got my legs in. You didn't have a book. <laughs> I, I had books, but... <laughs> you didn't get to use them. <laughs> they were wise to my tricks. <laughs> books were my ninja stars. Give me them books. This, your, your son was... Well, Evan, you know, I saw a need, and I went, God, you know, he needs <sighs> to see... No you... offense, Evan's autistic. He needs, you know, he needs he a needs lot everything. of... He needs everything. He needs everything explained to me. You're not supposed to hit Evan. Not even your own head. Yeah, right. I, put a, <laughs> I don't need a book. I'm putting a football helmet on my kid's head.
And with cartoons these days, you have oh dinosaurs God. killing turtles, and right. there's no actual situations that they deal with on the playground. <laughs> cartoons nowadays, Wiley uh, Coyote used to watch? get thrown off a cliff. Yeah, what did we watch? <laughs> Blown up with TNT from Acme all the time. Right. <laughs> I'm sure her, the cartoons were nice when she was growing up. My child needed a book on how not to hit. Regis is like, I understand you have tits. <laughs> yeah, what happened to the girl with the big tits? What, did you get those reduced? Probably the outfit was like buttoned up to her neck, you know, the right, top of her neck. Talking, you know, it's like Madonna yeah. when she reads her children's books. Yeah. She looks like a nun. I just want to say rest in peace, old Jenny. I miss you. She's gone. Yeah, you were so cute and fun and desperate. And I loved it. <laughs> desperate. It was so great. Jim Carrey ruined you. Let's be honest. Yeah, remember? She was in Playboy. Yeah. Big titties. Pull her fingers. She farts. They don't make them like that anymore. Rest in peace, darling. She got rescued just in time. What if Jim Carrey dumped her? Would she go back to that, you think, or is she too far the other way? Nah, Carrie will probably give her a bunch of dough when he dumps her. You think so? Sure. Yeah, she's yeah. in there. She, yeah, he's going to feel guilty. Yeah. He's all friends with the son and all that. She's practically the father, you know, um, and... So, you know, he's going to probably give her $5 million to us in the run away. Remember when Jenny peed in her pants in our tickle chair? Yeah. That's the Jenny I miss. She, notice she doesn't come here anymore. <laughs> Howard, remember when I peed in my pants in your tickle chair? <laughs> yeah, Jenny. Where did that girl go? I loved it. Anyway, what are you going to do? Mr. Blutowski. Zero point zero. You're out. Finished at Faber. Expelled. I want you off this campus at nine o'clock Monday morning.